Hi, I'm Josh. Uh, it's, a, it's kind of a tough thing to follow, but um, when, you know, when I turned 16, I was really excited to go skiing in the mountains, and my parents didn't let me go for the first year. They wanted to teach me what to, to do to drive well, and I thought they stunk, but it turns out that it's really, it was a really good thing. Uh, uh, I'm not a professional. I, uh, these are just things that I've found, you know, through driving in the mountains a lot. Um, so, you know, don't say I learned it from a pro. You know, this isn't going to get you out of tickets. That's in the second half. Um, so, you know, I, I've been driving in the mountains for 14 years. Um, you know, I go as much as I can. It, it, we're so lucky to have things so close to us that are, uh, I mean, you know, you don't get these everywhere. Um, with that, you know, mountain comes really danger. Um, you know, I know the American dream is to finish first and everything. Um, driving's not a race, you know. If, if the guy in the Porsche wants to go really fast, that's great. You know, my goal is to get where I want to go and go skiing. Um, and it should be yours too. Uh, it's also really important to know if your car's in good shape. Um, you know, if it's not, if you're not sure, you know, take it in. Um, there's a lot of things you can check, uh, things that I've found. You know, people will be honest. Uh, you know, you can really do bad things. Uh, Tires are really important, obviously. Uh, you know, this is, I stole this from a fish song, but uh, it, it, you know, it's really important. Um, you know, if your tires are bald, you're going to have problems, especially when the conditions are bad. I, I know it's starting to snow finally in the mountains. Um, so, you know, that's good. Uh, brakes, obviously, also very important. Um, if they don't work, you're going to be in trouble when you go down hills or uh, all that. So, you know, if, 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 if they're adjusted, you know, make sure they are. Um, as with everything in life, it's always important to keep track of your fluids. Um, you know, things like having a full tank of gas when you leave is a good idea. Um, if you've ever run out of wiper fluid on the way down from skiing, you know, on a snowy day, you'll know that you need it. Um, planning for problems is, is a big deal. Um, you know, I've been stuck in seven or eight hour traffic jams coming home from Vail. Um, so, you know, make sure you have a full tank of gas. Make sure you have water. Um, uh, sleeping bag is always good. Uh, some food. Uh, you know, it, sometimes it's snowing and you really want to go skiing, but maybe the highway's close. You know, you don't want to get stuck there. So I like to use cotrip.org. Uh, it's got road conditions, um, webcams, stuff like that. There's an iPhone app. Um, uh, so four-wheel drive does not equal four-wheel stop. I, you know, I have a Subaru and I've got all that stuff. But, uh, you know, be, be cautious. You know, don't follow too closely. Um, you know, know that you really can injure yourself. Um, probably my biggest pet peeve is people driving really slow in the left lane. Um, it, it's meant for passing, and if you are not keeping up with traffic or not passing people, stay in the right lane. It's okay to stay in the right lane. I don't have a problem with that, but you know, if I like to drive fast, let me drive fast. Um, don't ride your brakes down hills. Um, the steep grade sharp curves signs are real, so uh, gearing down is really nice. Um, if you have a, I mean, if you drive stick shift, you know what I'm talking about, but, uh, that's good. Keeping your distance is nice, you know, I'm not really big, uh, a big fan of those douches that, you know, ride right, right on you the whole time, and, um, you know, so, it's so, you know, just make, remember, we're trying to get where we're going. We're not trying to race or anything like that. Um, sometimes when it's wet, it can be icy, you know, you might you not know, so if you're unsure, you know, take it easy, go slow, it's okay, um, just stay in the right lane, please. Um, because, you know, I'm not telling you you have to drive the speed limit, but, you know, but don't get in my way. That's all I'm saying. Um, semis can be, they can be douches sometimes. I'm not saying they all are, but, you know, sometimes they are. Um, and if a woman named Large Marge picks you up in the mountains, just be really nice to her and try not to talk too much. Um, the other thing I hate is road rage. If you've ever been a victim of it or an aggressor, I'm not saying any of you are, um, the finger not the answer. It only, it only escalates things, you know? So, so my suggestion is to just go with the thumbs down. If somebody's, you know, if somebody's driving past you, you know, just, just give them a thumbs down. And, and, and it's, it's not aggressive. It's, it's something that says, you know, I see what you're doing and I, I totally do not approve of you. So, um, and, and, and that's, you know, that's what I'm getting at, you know? It, it's okay. And, and I, you know, my roommate came up with this. I'm a, I'm a huge fan of it, so. Um, yeah, and, and this was going to be probably more snarky, but um, some, some bad stuff happened in the last few weeks that I don't really want to get into. But if you, um, if you take a look at my Twitter page tomorrow or my blog, I'll probably 
explain more to you. So thank you very much. I'm Josh Michelle, and have fun.